Hello and welcome to Puzzle Master's product review. Today we will be taking a closer look at the Swift Shift puzzle. This puzzle was designed by Chinese puzzle designer Zhong Qi Zheng. Difficulty level of the Swift Shift puzzle is 10 out of 10 on a Puzzle Master's difficulty scale that runs from 5 to 10. And the objective of the puzzle is to remove all parts from the frame. This puzzle was made of aluminum alloy and milled by CNC. It is extremely well made puzzle and it feels very nice in hands. Also, it has a Chinese engravement on top. The Swift Shift puzzle comes in a box, in a quite well made box with magnetic lock and there is enough space to fit the puzzle inside. So it not only looks good as a puzzle, but it also comes in a beautiful box that you can put on your desk and put the puzzle inside. It will be a beautiful showpiece in a beautiful box. This puzzle is extremely difficult. It requires 33 steps to remove the first piece and 71 steps in total. And when the puzzle is disassembled, you have to assemble it uh, to complete the solution and you have to do 71 more steps to assemble everything back inside the frame. The parts, since they are uh, milled by CNC, they are extremely well made. The tolerances are extremely high and you have to do precise moves uh, to move the parts and to remove them from the frame. I solved this puzzle. It was quite fun solution. Not extremely difficult, uh, like when you have no idea how to solve the puzzle. Uh, here you can even find some logic in the solution, but the assembling will be even harder than the disassembling, but still it is a lot of fun to solve it since there are only six parts here three on this side and three on this side so it is not so uh, difficult to keep tracking on what you are doing unlike some other puzzles where you have like 12 pieces or even more those are insanely difficult but this one is doable and i'm pretty sure a lot of people want to buy it and have it in their collection so if you like the swift shift puzzle and you want to buy it since why don't you want to buy it. It's a beautiful puzzle, it comes in a beautiful box and it is quite fun to solve. So if you want to buy it, go to puzzlemaster.ca. See you next time.